Hello everybody and welcome to Tree Punching Brothers Vanilla Minecraft server. My name's Pinter J. Last episode we got this potato farm up and running and our little worker is doing a fantastic job for us. We have tons and tons of potatoes in here. Look at this, we almost have two double chests full already. And I had talked about putting in a carrot farm and I was able to get the carrot farm up and running. Uh, unfortunately, I did not have enough iron for all of the hoppers, so I had to go and borrow some iron from Double D, and he was nice enough to give us uh, a bunch of, I think I took like 16 blocks of iron, that is what I needed to finish off this farm, and it looks like this little worker is doing a fantastic job for us as well. Oh, I don't know how those stone bricks got in there, but we'll take them out of there. And look at this, we almost have a double chest full of carrots already. And that looks like all there is right there. A little, little bit of random ones up in here. We'll just put those in with the rest of them and let this one fill up right away. Uh, now, I am tired of running out of everything, so I decided to do a little mining session so we could get the iron that we needed to pay back double D. So I went and I took the beacon over a little ways over there. I decided to move a little ways away from my base because I didn't want this just giant hole down here in the basement of my place. And I just figured it'd be a lot nicer to move a little further away. So I went over there in like the plains area and dug down to about level, oh, we got a squishy over here dug down to about a level 9 and I did a little bit of speed mining down there for probably two hours, two and a half hours and dug pretty much the whole area out as far as I could in every direction uh, with the, until the beacon stopped working for me and there was a couple spots where I ran, well, what are you doing up in here? Where did he come from? Uh, but uh, in, there was a couple spots where I ran into some lava and stuff as well. But this is everything that we got from our little mining session here in this shulker box. And we'll take a look at this. Look at this. Four, over four stacks of diamonds. I think this is like 259 diamonds or something like that. 250. 56 diamonds or so. I don't really remember how much it was. What, how many diamonds do we have here? Let's take a look at this. 265 diamonds is what we have right here. Then we have a full block uh, or a full stack of blocks of iron and a little bit extra and then a bunch of lapis, tons of redstone, tons of coal and some gold. So I think I borrowed like 16 like I said from Double D. So we're going to pay him a little interest since we have so much there. There's 16 and we'll pay him 20 blocks since we have quite a bit here. I'm going to take this and put it back in my ender chest. Now what I have over here in this one is uh, for another project that I'm going to work on. So we'll pick that up and we'll take that with us. We'll go over and we'll pay back Double D. Alright, so we're over here on Double D's little island and I'm pretty sure this is where I took it from. Right there is he's got some blocks of iron, so we'll give him these 20 blocks of iron back as repayment for what we took. Uh, let's get over here and start working on this project that I wanted to do today. I'm probably not going to do all of it on camera, but I want to at least get some of it started. And I'm not sure if I'll finish it all in one episode. Um, might just work on it in between episodes. But I wanted to get a room made for the end portal. Because it, the one that we have in here is just, you know, it's the fort or the stronghold and it's just, you know, dirty and grimy looking. And if I can come through the portal. Where am I? I'm lost in the void. All right. Yeah. Well, and now I'm stuck in the portal. Yeah. I think we could do a lot better than this gross, grimy stuff here. So I'm going to make a room here for the portal and I'm gonna start digging all of this out now, I think I'm gonna need like a 21 by 21 area first thing we're gonna want to do though is get rid of this lava under here and then we can dig this up and I have most of my materials that I think I'm gonna need we'll have to get rid of this stuff here as well I think I have most of the materials that I'm gonna need in here now we might run out of some stuff like, uh, I probably don't have enough quartz right here, and maybe not enough end stone. 
and maybe not enough wool but this was all the wool I could gather up right now and then we'll have to maybe collect some more stuff now I'm hoping that I only need five of these sea lanterns but uh hopefully SC medic gets that farm up and running uh, by the week I think he said he wanted to get it done by the weekend so that would be awesome but yeah I think this is pretty much the palette we're gonna go with we kind of want to make it look like the end uh, like some end city area and then maybe uh, throw in some obsidian and I'm gonna use the wool for the flooring and stuff like that so I'm gonna get to work on digging this out and then we'll start laying stuff down
have the end portal room pretty much finished off and I did something rather foolish yet again two videos in a row where I've done something rather foolish I uh, went I was recording and I did the intro and everything and everything was fine and then I went and I turned off my microphone because I was gonna do a little digging uh, for the edit and such and then uh, I came back after I got done eating and I was gonna record some more and well I forgot to turn the microphone back on oh like a freaking noob I forgot to turn the microphone back on so we might have to I just I decided just to like record the building process and I think I recorded the majority of me building this so we might have to uh, kind of splice it together and edit it into a montage now I'm sorry I'm sorry that it's gonna be another montage but what better way to show a lot of work in a short period of time than with a montage we need a montage we need a minecraft building montage we're gonna do it in a montage a minecraft building montage at any rate guys I apologize for <laughs> the montage but um hopefully you enjoyed it uh we like i said we pretty much have this all finished up but uh with just a couple things left to do i have to remove this dirt from the top of the end portal uh, i just had that there so i didn't accidentally fall in while i was working and we need to relight the portal that goes into the nether now i'll show you a little bit of stuff that i've done here uh, we have just the main room here, a uh, little bit of glass hanging down there. I like that, like that a lot. And a little bit of uh, decoration with some purple flowers. And so, you know, the purple and make it look like end city and the end rods. And then I tried to make this look like it was the over the void. And it's a little too bright. You can kind of see. I'm pretty sure this thing gives off light. I'm not sure why that's giving off light, but I'm pretty sure it does. I mean, it's not quite as dark as I would like it to be uh, but we don't want things spawning up on top of here so we kinda have to have a little more light than I would prefer but I th think it still kinda gives you that feel of like you know wide open space underneath you and everything and it's pretty much the best we could do the only thing darker I think would be coal and that would be a lot of coal because I had to use carpet for the bottom of this and I used a lot of carpet for this but anyway over here in the corners we have little rooms so you can store some stuff whatever you get from the end or and then we have ender chests in here a bed you can sleep in before you go into the end and then uh, another room over here which is pretty much just the mirrored image of the other one over there uh, I did go into the end and found a couple end banners these magenta banners uh, I'd like to have more than this but that I didn't really feel like it's getting late I didn't really feel like spending all night in the end looking for cities just to get the banners uh, maybe some members of the server have some extra ones that we could get some because I'd like to have at least two on each wall but for now I think we're just gonna place uh, one here one here and then one over here and then one here as well and I think that'll probably be good enough for now I think it looks alright it's kinda uniform uh, we might even want some over here but you know we don't want to overdo it at the same rate you know, or at the same time you know so let's get rid of this dirt and make this room official by lighting this portal and make sure that it goes back into the nether and uh, one other thing I wanted to show is I put this little room here in back of the portal so you could still go into the fortress the stronghold if somebody wanted to come in and clean out all of the mossy and cracked bricks that are in here uh, or explore stuff further I know there's other areas that have iron and other things like that but I just kinda you know made this a little nice with some stairs and dressed this up a little bit just so if like I said if anybody was interested in coming in here they could still get access to that through this little room right here and then we have this nice beautiful new end portal room for everybody to enjoy so let's go through this portal make sure that it goes back to the portal in the nether 
And it looks like it does. Everything looks like it's synced up pretty well. But I think that'll do it for this episode. Again, sorry to be one note and do everything with montages. <laughs> but uh, that's just the way it had to work out. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, if you did enjoy the montage, if you enjoyed the video, please hit a like, hit a subscribe, and I will talk to you in the next episode.